I'm Sriram Venkatesh. I work at Big Bandry, and I'm also part of the Kubernetes release team. And I'm going to talk about how we are building our own cloud deployment platform. So I gave a talk uh, at last year's DevOps days. I'm kind of trying to build an infinite mirror effect here. And uh, yeah, I was supposed to give a talk, a full-length talk this time, but uh, I was too busy fixing production that I kind of missed the deadline. So this is fine. Yeah, so at Big Bandry, we used to use Heroku for all our deployments from review apps to production. And uh, last year, around September, they were like, yeah, we are not going to give uh, free plans anymore. So it would mean that we would uh, end up paying a lot of money for the PR review apps that we were using, which we were running on the free tire. So we decided that we'll just build our own Heroku, because that's what we do as engineers, right? So. Over the last year, we built uh, Neato Deploy. So for some con context, uh, we have our own uh, suite of business software called Neato uh, with applications like desk, uh, chat, and all. And uh, on top of that, we were building Neato Deploy. Uh, and uh, last year, when I gave this talk, uh, we only had uh, a bare bones application, and we only had a uh, the review apps feature, but over the last one year, we've been shipping a lot of features. And uh, yeah, I just thought I'll uh, walk you through everything. Uh, so this is the Neato Deploy dashboard right now. Once you've connected your GitHub repository and uh, like hit uh, deploy latest commit. So here you can have as many processes as you want, each of which is a Kubernetes deployment. And uh, like you can scale them manually based on your requirement, or you can also enable auto scaling based on custom metrics that we get from Prometheus Adapter. Uh, this is actually supposed to include uh, network metrics as well, but I just raised the PR last day, and it, has in, it hasn't been merged yet. So close. And uh, we also have metrics and uh, alerts based on the metrics. And we also have support for historical logs right now. You can create add-ons, like if your app needs like Redis, PostgreSQL, Elasticsearch, Kafka, or MySQL, like you can provision add-ons, and you can scale them based on your load. You can also use custom build packs, like cloud native build packs. You just need to enter the uh, GitHub repository URL of the build pack, and you can use it in your project. And uh, yeah, it, last year has been a really interesting journey, like exploring all the different projects in the cloud native ecosystem and uh, like bringing our platform together. So the ideal consumer of uh, this product is someone who is a beginner or someone who doesn't want to like, think much about their deployment. So we are like, we'll do the varying for you. So if you're using Heroku, you would need to pay for additional add-ons like Judo Scale or Paper Trail if you want to use features like auto scaling or uh, historical logs on top of the bills that you're already paying for Heroku. So we are trying to build a platform which, which has everything that you would need to create and manage your deployments. Yeah, uh, if you're interested in trying out Neato Deploy, uh, you can hit me up. You can also check out my blog, uh, which is a Schrodinger's uh, blog of posts, which are always in a state of uh, draft and published at the same time. You can also hit me up on Twitter, or I'll, I'll be around. You can uh, yeah, talk if you're interested. Thank you.